Welcome to Extra Extra presented by VDG Sports. I'm your host, Vince Douglas Gregory. No filter. Very center. I'm no movie expert, but see something, say something. I am no movie expert, but see something, say something, and I am starting to notice something. Probably like a few of you. I'm noticing something, and it is making me a little... Well, actually, correction. It is making me a lot, a lot, lot, lot cray-cray. It is driving me mad. It is making me go insane. That little, uh, that little sticker that they give you to let you know that you are sane. My, my, my stickers fading away. It is about to bite the dust. It is about to be destroyed. It, 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 with, with help. With help. Not on its own, with help. I admit, I do have a unique, I admit, I have a unique uh, taste when it comes to movies and TV shows and that form of entertainment. And I'm going to, I am going to take this out of it. I am going to take the unique taste out of it, the unique part out of it. What my expectations, my standards, my way of observing works of art, my way of observing film, action, actors, decisions made, choices not made. I'm taking all of that away and I am just stripping this down, stripping this down to the entertainment factor, an entertainment factor at the very, very bare, bare minimum. Not upper echelon, not the best of the best of the best, not the 1%, not even the 3%. I'm talking about barely getting by. Just give me anything above 50 and I will accept 50%. Just give me half. Just give me half. And this is the entertainment factor for this purpose only. Entertainment factor for this purpose only and not necessarily of how I would normally go about doing things just for this, just for this exercise, just for this exercise. I consume a lot of, I guess, TV, TV shows, movies, and it's not even from watching it live or watching it as it airs. This is more uh, on demand. My time, my settings, when I need to, when I want to, me, 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 me. Yes. I'm that, I'm that guy. And that, and so I've come across shows. I've come across various forms of entertainment where I'm scratching my head and wondering how did we get here? How did we get here? And there were a few answers that was just rattling it around my brain and I took that with me to uh, to uh, the, not the happy place, but I took that with me right at the right at the right at the, the the steps of the happy place so right before i go to uh sleep or one of the steps to the happy place and it definitely uh affected my uh sleep sleep patterns and the way i uh sleep in the way i would want and the way i would like to sleep yes 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 basically some TV shows should not be TV shows and they just should be movies. Whoa, whoa, what? Yes. Some TV shows should not be TV shows and they should just be two to three movies. And I'm trying to figure out and I'm trying to understand 
Why are they a TV show to begin with? Yeah, eight episodes don't make you a, a TV show. Ten episodes don't make you a TV show. What makes you a TV show is you're calling it a TV show. But following the, the setup or the principles or the regular rules of a show, if you want to go into depth or observation point point of view, it's not. In other words, in more words, in some words upon words upon words, eight episodes to tell a story that could have been told in one episode or one movie when it just seems the action is stale the uh, drama is isn't there the, uh, the 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 entertainment is slow the entertainment is dragging along the entertainment is something that felt forced and not natural and i don't know if this is just a pure cash grab if so, more power to you. Get that cash, get that money, do it, do it, do it, do it. I'm not going to say you shouldn't get the bag. I'm not going to say you should not take the bag and leave the bag for somebody else. I'm just saying, if you continue to take the bag when you probably shouldn't be taking the bag because the bag uh the bag was misplaced or the bag was meant for something else once you go for the bag in the future or once you go for the bag again and you're going to realize that that bag isn't there that bag is gone that bag is <gasps> it's light it is light not lit but it's light meaning the monies isn't rolling in like they used to anymore. And that is because the people got, uh, the people figured out that this, these TV shows really aren't TV shows. They're elongated movies. They're basically three movies during a season you get three movies during this particular time and you still might not be satisfied because if they set it up that way you best believe if if there is another season it will be the same exact system the same exact concepts making something that should be building something that should have some kind of direction into a movie that should have ended but started again and started again and not necessarily like an act act one act two act three act four not necessarily an act either not an act and that is definitely something that I started to realize more and more and more as the TV shows get pumped out more and more and more. I believe this is definitely something that's not going to go away tomorrow like I would like it to. It's something that I'm going to have to deal with. Something that we are going to have to deal with for X amount of time until, until the bag is light. Until making TV shows into three or four movies become the new bag 
And w- until any of that happened or a combination of that and other things that I did not mention just for the sake of not forcing anyone else to go down a rabbit hole that they aren't willing to go now. Uh-uh. We don't do that here. We don't do that here. Don't go down somebody else's rabbit hole. Go down your own. And I can't say that I am surprised because there have been movies made where it should have ended with the first and it's still going. Get that bag. Get that. Get that bag. Because I can. I can figure it out. We can eventually figure it out. And if someone's watching a movie past the first, the second, the third, the fourth, the fifth. I can honestly tell you they ain't going there to hate watch it. They're going there because it brings them some form of entertainment, mind you. We might not like it. I might not like it. You may not like it. But it brings them some form of entertainment. And in the long run, that is all that matter in in the eyes of the person that's being entertained by whatever is deemed unacceptable by one person or by many persons. And that's why I I can say that I'm not um uh, I'm not looking at this from the point of view of directions uh material decisions made observations that I would normally make and determine whether or not this movie this TV show is watchable or not I'm going by the bare minimum is it entertaining you can drag out a plot drag out a story for so long until every decision that an actor, an actress, the character can make has been made. Now we're just at the point of will will they make a decision that they normally make? Or would they make a decision that they won't make? And when start venturing into the ter- territory or territory, depending on who you are. Depending on the territory or territory, it can be fulfilling and it can be unsatisfactory. Entertaining, not entertaining. Makes sense, nonsensical. And there's this balance. But what cannot be disputed is it could, it can be if you're contrarian. But if you're contrarian, nobody believes you anyway because you just do this for fun. This is your, this is your, uh, this is your gig. This is what you do. This is what you do. It'll be hard to, it'll be hard to believe that entertainment a little bit above 50%, but yet nothing else is really flowing and making that that big of a leap, that big of a jump for having more of the episode or having more of the season once 
everything's been exhausted. Everything could have ended and finished with and when the characters ran out of choices and started making abnormal decisions that they normally will and won't make. That's when suspending disbelief no longer is uh, in suspension. It's either hanging on by a tiny, tiny thread or it is laid out on the floor somewhere. Happy days. Happy days. Thank you for listening. Thank you for listening. Be sure to check out the website. Be sure to check out the website extra extra dot vdg sports dot com. That is x t r a x t r a dot v d g s p o r t s dot c o m. There's a YouTube as well. Like, subscribe, share. But you probably need to know where to go, and that is vdg sports. This episode, I guess I haven't been saying it, but let me just go ahead and put that in there. Slipping in right now. This episode is not being sponsored by VinceDouglasGregory.com. VinceDouglasGregory.com is where you can keep up with me, my whereabout, my well-being, everything in between. I know, I know it'd be so long in between, but it's worth it. It's worth it. You know what to do. You know what to do. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Peace. Out, out, out. Nah, peace out. Yeah, this is peace out. Out. I gave you a little. Accepted.